Welcome back to our channel. Today we got a new video and some updates. So let's get to it. So we've been living the last week with the Antelope Orion Studio. Now that's from Antelope Audio. Uh, you may have seen us do like a video on, hey, we got some new gear. That's the new piece of gear. It's Antelope Audio. It's uh, an older unit. It's not the newest one. It's not the Synergy Cores. It's actually a legacy unit, not the 2017 unit either. It's actually, I think maybe before that, it might be Mark a Mark One unit, which is fine by me. It works great. Um, but it's had some quirks. Uh, one, it's Thunderbolt 2 and USB. The quirk is we have Thunderbolt 2. We have no other devices that are Thunderbolt 2. <laughs> uh, the only other device that has Thunderbolt is the laptop and that's Thunderbolt 4, which uh, if you do buy a unit like this that has Thunderbolt 2, a legacy unit, or what they consider a legacy unit, it's not really that old. Consider either having, a, if you have an older computer, it's fine, but if you have something that has Thunderbolt 4, Thunderbolt 4 is not backwards compatible. Doesn't do it. So, oh, it's got USB, so we're great. Uh, so we plugged it in USB, not thinking that with the Orion, um, with this generation Orion, I don't know about the other ones, but this one, generation of Orion Studio, that the USB is not all 32 channels. It's actually only 24, but that didn't stop us because Antelope has actually a pretty great, at least in my opinion, a digital patch bay built into their IO system that comes with it. So you can go in digitally through their app that you put on your computer, you go through there, and you can actually patch any input, any output, just like you would with a real patch bay. Uh, so that kind of helped us out quite a bit, especially in Logic, where Logic only shows 24 inputs and 24 outputs. We got the inputs working, that's great. But then we're like, oh, we need to set up our mix chain. Well, our mix chain comes out a set of channels and comes back in a set of channels. But since you can patch things everywhere, you have to kind of think, oh, well, actually it comes through these channels. So in our studio, we're gonna be rocking 24 channels where actually 20 of those channels are mic pre's. Uh, we have a set of clarets from Focusrite that we actually use as our even when we had Apollos, we use those more as kind of our main IO and they do sound good. They have patching on the back of them for inserts so I can insert some of the gear we have all around us here. And that's kind of what we're gonna use them for. So we got that all working, got the mics working, tested lines, everything's working, but uh, we had to figure out what the last four channels were gonna be. So we've got a stereo from our Oxbox. That's gonna be, that's I think our last set of channels. And then we had to figure out how to get our IO from our mix chain. And that took a little trial and error and it's been great. So that's kind of what's been going on here. Uh, we did build a riser for our screen back here. You'll maybe see a short on that or something, but I just wanted the screen to get up above our SSL unit. Um, has nothing to do with the Orion. It's just an update um, on the space itself. Uh, but the Orion's been great. It sounds good. The clocking in it is fantastic. Um, they put mastering grade clocking into all of their gear that they build. They build master clocks. You can't go wrong with their clocks, their mastering grade. But that's kind of where we are with the Orion. We're gonna kind of keep updating you guys on how it goes. Maybe we'll do a session with it. We'll get a band in here and record a band and see how the Orion functions when you put a full band in here. You just don't know until you get people in here. And speaking of people, hit the like and subscribe. All you guys, hit the like and subscribe for everything that we do, um, but only if you like it. Don't make us, no, don't think I'm forcing you. Just, if you like our content, hit the like and subscribe because we got a lot of people watch who don't. In that case, I'm Justin. This is Fox and Robin recording. Go make some music and we'll see you next time.